Hey guys, it's Lady T and welcome back to the channel. Jen Shaw of the Real Housewives of Salt Lake City has pleaded guilty for her role in the fraudulent multi-state telemarketing scheme. On Monday, the reality star entered a guilty plea in Manhattan Federal Court to one count of conspiracy to commit wire fraud in connection with the telemarketing through which she victimized 10 or more people over the age of 55. From 2012 to March 2021 in the Southern District of New York and elsewhere, I agree with the others to commit wire fraud. Shaw told the U.S. District Judge of the scheme, which run in six states over the last 10 years. I did this knowingly providing customers' name to people who was marketing business services that had little to no value. She admitted, I knew it was wrong. I know many was harmed and I am sorry. Shaw will be sentenced on November 28 and the court carries a maximum sentence of 30 years in prison. However, her plea agreement with the federal prosecutors called for a sentence of anywhere between 11 to 14 years in prison. The judge ultimately determines the sentence. As part of the plea deal, Shaw will forfeit $6.5 million and pay restitution up to $9.5 million. Jennifer Shaw was the key participant in a nationwide scheme that targeted elderly vulnerable victims. U.S. Attorney for the Southern District New York Damian Williams said in a statement, these victims were sold false promises of financial security, but instead Shaw and her co-conspirators defrauded them out of their savings and left them without nothing to show for it. The office is committed to rooting out these schemes, whatever form they take. Shaw, who's an original Real Housewives of Salt Lake City cast member was arrested in March of 2021 along with her assistant Stuart Smith for the telemarketing scheme that do people in New York and several other states to invest in an online business opportunity and sold them tax preparation or website design services even though many didn't even own computers. She originally pleaded not guilty and her trial was to begin on July the 18th. Smith pleaded guilty in November. Prosecutor said last week that Smith will testify against Shaw in trial. Shaw's legal situation have been the storyline on the Bravo show. The spinoff premiere in 2020 and Shaw flashed her wealth from the start. During season one reunion, executive show producer Andy Cohen asked her, why do you have four assistants? press on exactly what she did for work she replied my background is in direct response marketing for about 20 years so our company does advertising we have a platform that helps people acquire customers so when you're shopping online or on the internet and something pops up we have the algorithm behind why you're getting served that ad Shaw continued to film the show now in this third season for now all right guys that's it hope you enjoyed the video let's continue the conversation down below in the comments make sure to like the video and hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you never miss an upload i'm lady t i'll catch you the next time be blessed bye